Hello all, we the team Debug Squad, we have proposed the implementation of automated biogas system with safety measures. So the, we, uh, from our proposal, the implementation is of three stages. The first stage being the pre-processing stage, where in which the input is fed into the digester tank. Here we have considered cow dung as the input and it is fed into the digester tank. The second stage is the digestion, which is a very important stage because an anaerobic digestion process takes place, where in which the cow dung goes into certain chemical reactions and produces methane. So the internal conditions, the parameters are considered are temperature, humidity, pH, the methane, the rate that is produced. So for that measurement, we have considered the methane sensor, the pH sensor, the temperature humidity sensor, the pressure sensor and the pH sensor that is immersed in the digest state. So all these sensors are connected together and they are integrated through the Aries board. Since this is an anaerobic digestion process, the valves connected here and the um, wires that are taken from the lid are all sealed in such a way that the um, air doesn't enter inside and the anaerobic digestion process takes place. So uh, from our, for our proposal, the main key important factor is that the balancing of the internal conditions. This is done in order to enhance the methane production. So internal conditions are balanced by using the cases considered. So we, if the humidity of the cow dung gets very low, if it becomes very dry, then the, it is indicated by the Aries board to the 5 volt DC motor that is connected to the uh, relay motor uh, relay, and the water is fed into the tank. Similarly, if uh, pH goes above or below its desired range, then acid, acidic acid is fed and base sodium bicarbonate is fed inside the digester tank, thus maintaining the internal conditions. This stabilizes the digestion tank and also enhances the methane production, which is a key important factor of our implementation and if we consider and on running the code we can see that for the internal conditions like the all the parameters stated are measured from the pH sensor they are sent to the uh, server and if there is any change in the internal parameters then they are balanced by using all these external thing uh, additives that are attached so when uh, when uh, we have uh, manually returned, we have manually uh, in, in increased the humidity in order to check whether the water pump works. So as you can see, the water pump works and the water is fed into the digestive tank, and it gets off after a certain a certain a certain amount a certain amount of time. So thus, based on this, the humidity of the tank is enriched. So th this is the entire implementation of the second thing, and this process is completely automated. And the third and important stage is the storage stage. Since we have implemented this just a day before the methane production rate is not to the satisfied level. Hence what happens is that we cannot apply a storage tank separately. And the last and final part is the safety. So the safety is the important condition. Safety we have implemented in the digester tank by using the pressure sensor that is considered. So the pressure sensor monitors any deviation, any uh, pressure deviation that is if the pressure goes low then it indicates that is a leakage. This part is very, it has very high response time, hence this part of leakage testing is implemented. Hence safety of the digest tank is also considered. So hence the process keeps on taking place, hence after water required is done, the process keeps continuing hereafter. So thus the data collected, everything is sent to the, to the cloud by using the Bolt IoT module that is considered. The baud rate of the Bolt IoT module doesn't match with the Aries board, hence we are working on it in order to have proper data transfer to the cloud. Thus, this process implementation entirely implements the automation of biogas with safety measures. In the POC demonstration, we were not able to show the motor working because of improper wire connections. We have rectified it. Thank you so much.